Monterrey in the Rio de Janeiro. We, uh, we had a good flight, uh, late, late night flight. I got myself some noise canceling headphones. Best investment you possibly buy. It wasn't, it was like it wasn't even on a plane. So uh, once we landed in Rio, we, we went to the rental car place. They screwed us hardcore. We were, we were, we were there for in the airport probably another two and a half, three hours. They screwed us around. We didn't have a GPS. We don't exactly know our way around here. We ain't busting out a map and we don't want to get lost in the favelas out here. That's the last thing the last thing we're going to do out here. So now uh, we're at our, uh, our first day, full day here. We're out on the beach. We're just enjoying the nice weather. I think it's like 32 degrees now. Last time we were here it was a lot of overcast, so it's a little bit nicer now. We're gonna we're gonna bust out some skull. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. How much? How much? Quanto? Six. Okay. After come by, we'll, we'll bust out some. Uh, we'll get some drama. Drama. So yeah, today's our full first full day on the beach, and uh, tomorrow we're in the studio, and we'll get back to you on that. Let you know how it goes. Opa. Opa. Hey everybody, we're in uh, Rio de Janeiro. Uh, about to go to Super Fuzz, one of the best studios in Rio de Janeiro. So let's go check it out. Welcome to Super Fuzz, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Brazil. So this is the first room when we walk in. I love all the flyers that uh, they have here, all the different bands and their own bands. Xander, number one. Xander, you know, the best. And uh, let's take a walk into the control room. How awesome is this? What's going on, guys? So this is the main floor, as you can see, which is absolutely beautiful. All this stuff happens in that chance, correct? Beautiful sound room, awesome. <laughs> we're, about to, we're about to track the song entitled uh, Anything For You. We wrote the song about a week ago. Um, we talked to Xander uh, about doing a collaboration on it, uh, including. Uh, the vocals of Gabriel on it and, uh, and tracking it here in Rio and we're super excited to do it. Uh, we were talking on Facebook a, a few months ago uh, about trying to get this song done and, and you know sort of doing a song down here for the first time outside of Canada which is pretty exciting. They've been super welcoming and super friendly. They took us in and we have the whole day here just to track the whole song and uh, they're currently setting up the drum mics right now. Um, it's super hot and super awesome and it, it beats all the negative weather that we're having up north. Uh, but yeah, we're super happy to be here. The song is going to sound awesome, and tomorrow night we rock at Saloon 79 with Novo Zero Nove and Xander. It's going to be an awesome show. Uh, and the song that we're actually recording today is going to be free because we wrote it for the people of Brazil, for all the good friends and fans that we have down here, and we love to come back. It's our second tour here, and we'll be sure to be uh, come back in the future because we just love Brazil down here. It's the best.
going to do some east. gang vocals here with Gabriel and Giuseppe and Chris Cruz and Lex Mascarin. Do you think we should do a Lex Wee? Wee! <laughs> Take the wire. Yeah. <laughs> 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 What the hell is she saying? We're getting attacked by a goddamn lizard? It uses the jungle. You saying that Blaine and Hawkins were killed by a fucking lizard? What's going on, guys? Anthony here from We Outspoken in beautiful Florianopolis, Brazil. Man, what to say about uh, our time spent here? Well, for starters, this is our last show. Um, we play Rio de Janeiro. Sao Paulo, Curitiba, Florianopolis tonight. It's going to be sad to leave uh, this beautiful country. But um, Rio, the show is absolutely amazing. The guys in Xander, um, Nova Zero Nova as well. They showed us a great time. Spectacular. Warm welcome to start the tour. This man, the tits right here. Those yeah. guys. We had spoken. We had an amazing time in the studio yesterday. One. Yeah. Uno. Primo. Primo. This is the Brazilian rise against right here. <laughs> Say hello, amigo. <laughs> this guy rules, man, right here. This is why we come to Rio. show, got to meet some great fans, great people, um, just all in all, you really feel the love, uh, especially for a band like us who comes from Canada, it feels great to be appreciated, and also too, it was great connecting with fans and people that we've been talking to, right, and finally get to meet them and sing with them, you know. <laughs> Curitiba last night was over the top. Um, every time we play in Curitiba, the show is just absolutely amazing. The guys in Abrascadabra, just amazing people. Um, great friends. Again, got to meet some amazing fans as well, and uh, the energy level of that show was just, just over the top again. You know, uh, it's sad to, to leave that place. It's one of one of my favorite, at least, to play. Um, so just success across the board. Bang! Bang! Yeah. No, 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 it's like this. <laughs> it's easy, man. Yeah. That's a, that's a bang. Like my guitar's gonna make a noise. <laughs> bang, 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 bang! Bang, bang! There it
Tonight is the last night, as I mentioned. It's going to be sad leaving, but, uh, you know, someone told me last night, the Brazilian culture, you know, it really is about standing up for you, believing and fighting, fighting for the, your goals and dreams. And uh, I'm happy that we can be a part of that through music. And, uh, of course, our bracelets, you know, be strong, be you. Something to remember when, um, when you feel like the going is tough. Yeah, absolutely amazing. No fish, fish here? It's our amazing hotel. Did you get the password? Florinopolis. I know, I don't have it yet. We got a three bed special here. This awesome hammock. Game over, man. Game over. Yeah, yeah, Bishop can do it. Bishop can go. Yeah. Fuck you. You want some too? Huh? Ah! <laughs> game over, man. It's game over. What the fuck are we gonna do now? All right, man. Bishop should go. Good idea. Come on. Come on, you bastard. Come on, you two. Oh, you want some of that? Fuck you! Ah! Fuck you! So, uh, we played Florianopolis last night. Wicked show, it's our first time being down to the city, and I gotta say, we all loved it. Fantastic show, fantastic pe people, and the, and the scenery and the ocean, just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Um, show was in this really cool venue. This guy from Montreal actually ran it. He was awesome. Awesome dude. We played with End of Pipe again. Uh, so, like, they, they killed it. They rocked it. Um, today we got to relax. As yesterday was the last show. So we just took the time to settle down. Had an awesome beach day. Some good pesh. Uh, and now we're, uh, we're driving through the jungle. Uh, and along the coastline, on our way back to Kirchi, we're gonna go hang out with some of our best buddies here in, uh, in Brazil. The jungle, it came alive and it took him. Você? She says the jungle, it just came alive and took him. Bullshit! It's not what she said. What she said doesn't make any sense. Maranhão, you know. We're at Rainin's house, awesome. right now. Amazing. Good friends, good people. Why do not say huge? Um, say huge, but yeah, it's best in addition that which does have in Maranhão, you know, and folk uh, just bought it. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah. There's a the wonderful chef. Hey, I hope you like it. Oh, we're gonna love it. I hope so. You better. <laughs> Look at this amazing meal. Look at this. She did it. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. This is number one. I number one. This is the tits. Pain in hook shop. TMO. Why don't we just put the girl in charge? Why don't you put her in charge? You better just start. Hey, this is Joe and Chris. We're half a wheel spoken. We're uh, right now we're at the airport, uh, leaving Brazil to go back home uh, to Canada, and uh, we had an amazing time. Got a, quite the uh, adventure we had. We uh, we saw a lot of stuff that we don't, we definitely don't see back home. There's a lot of road trucks, buses. They just switch lanes without. They switch lanes like their car, like that seconds. They take over the road. We saw a bus turn so fast, its back wheel lifted off the road. That's how fast this bus was booking around the corner. We also, there's like crazy bikes on the highway, um, and you would think the trucks are the worst thing that you gotta worry about, but no, like, trucks you can, you got some time you gotta deal with, but like when you're trying to avoid a truck, or you like change lanes, and you have a bike in your blind spot ripping up over the middle lane, just like passing trucks, like narrow spaces, and it like, almost makes your heart drop into your stomach. Like, it's, it's absolutely insane. No helmets, 
One guy we saw with no shoes, bare yes. feet. It's crazy. Booking it. The, the just traffic to like places that you think like, okay, we look it up and it's like, all right, three hours by car. Add double that time. Just add on another three hours to get, get to the shows. It, it's crazy. You don't get it. It's, you know, you just have to avoid that traffic and you gotta grin and bear it. And it, it sucks, but it's a price for play. You pay for glory, right? We went to a, a strip mall too at one of our shows. Um, it was right across the street from our the venue. We played with uh, with Alex, uh, the first director, it's Cactus. It was like a big soup, almost like a Walmart kind of. And, underground parking. Uh, yeah, underground Restaurant. parking. And uh, huge, huge. It was, it was like a huge Walmart, like just as big. And all the employees, they all had rollerblades. So they're running around the supermarket like the stock people are putting all the stock in. They're on rollerblades. I'm like, this was back home. Just who WSIB would, would have them. Yeah. Yeah. Just waiting to happen. We went we, down to uh, Florinopolis, uh, which we, we touched on a little bit. I know we talked about it. Anthony talked about it. We had the beautiful, uh, beautiful hotel. But it was our first time being down there. Like, as, as you guys know, we came down to the last year. Total beach city. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. People are awesome. The show was great. The venue was amazing. So that was that was a new experience for us. Uh, shout out to, uh, to Miss Andrews. Take care of your boy. See, so he's, he's eating, he's eating a nice Italian meal, pasta. Not a Mars bar and French fries. And Cheers this time. Yeah. He did eat all that shit too, but. Hey guys, what's going on? We're in São Paulo, Brasil. Um, yeah, the tour has come to an end, and uh, I gotta say that we had such an amazing time here. Good friends, good people, um, warm weather, of course, and our second tour. So it's absolutely amazing. Uh, last night, we went to our friend's house, um, Greenan and Alessandra. Uh, they made an amazing meal for us. Um, took us into their home, made us feel welcome. You know, it's always good to have good people in other countries, especially people that you're so close to. Um, yeah, at least made an amazing meal. Um, a lot to drink, a lot to eat. It was a great way to uh, send us home on this tour. Uh, send us back with full bellies and uh, good, good spirits. So uh, I want to thank those guys. Caralho! 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 Filha da puta! Filha da puta! Poo poo! Pay do! I'm gonna make pay do a million times. Pay do! On a glass table.